what is up welcome back to my channel how y'all doing uh so today it's saturday good morning i'm up and ready bundled up because it's cold here in florida today and i'm getting ready to go to the store i'm going to make a keto friendly crab salad and um a shrimp salad today so if you're interested in seeing how i do that keep watching because it is delicious um it's like a fresh like summery type of salad so but it requires a lot of chopping and my hand really hurts today I got some swelling going on so we'll see maybe i can con my brother into helping me do that we'll see um but yeah I haven't had it in a long time, but it is delicious. I need to go to the store right now and get all the ingredients. So if you're interested in seeing that, keep watching. Um, if you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe. If you're not new here, thanks for coming back. Thanks for hanging out with me. Um, the birds are kind of loud this morning. Sorry. Um, and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you like it. So if you're interested in seeing how I make this crab salad and shrimp salad, keep watching. All right, I just got back from the store, guys, and I'm getting ready to chop up all of the ingredients that I got. Obviously, I have here tomatoes, lime, a cucumber, purple onion, cilantro, and avocado, but we're not going to chop this yet. Um, and then I got the imitation crab meat. I do have some shrimp in the sink. I don't know if I'm going to add the shrimp. I haven't quite decided if that's what I want to do yet, but this is all you need for the crab salad. It is a very fresh tasting, like I said, summer salad, tastes so good. So what you do is chop this crab meat up, put it in the bowl. Then you chop the tomatoes, try to get all of the, the um, seasoned stuff out that you can, put that in the bowl. You chop the cucumber and seed it, put that in the bowl, chop the, um, chop the onion, Add that to the bowl, chop some cilantro, add that to the bowl, and then you squeeze lime over the top of everything. You can cut avocado and put it in there. That is your choice. Um, I kind of like to wait until I'm actually eating it and then put it on the side. Not so keto friendly, but the idea of this is to use it like it's a salad, but also like a dip. So you can dip, um, use it use corn chips to dip it and scoop it up with, if that's what you choose to do. I don't eat it that way. I just um, cut and mix and marinate all the flavors and add it all to one big bowl. And then I eat it as a salad like that. All right guys, so we are done. My brother did help me do the chopping because I think we just did that in record time. So this is what it looks like when it's all done. We already taste tested. And it's delicious, and it is a nice, refreshing salad. Summer salad, but you know what? It's not that warm today in Florida, but it's good. We're done making the salad. It is delicious. So now what you do is, oh, don't forget to add salt to that. Um, once you squeeze the, squeeze the lime over the top, add a little salt in there also. So we are done with the salad. It tasted delicious. I had one tortilla chip. I ate it with it, half of one. Um, but it was so good and I cannot wait to eat that later. We'll put it in the fridge and let all the flavors marinate together and we'll have that for maybe a lunch or a dinner. It is only 11 o'clock and I could eat a lot of that right now. I'm so hungry. It's right here. It looks so delicious. Look at that. Look how good that looks. All those flavors are gonna marinate and it's gonna be delicious. It is delicious because we already tried it. So, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. See you in the next one.